I don't really know what I just saw from the Leafs and the Bruins, but Toronto's down one nothing in the series after getting spanked 5-1 by the Bruins, and if I were a Leaf diehard, I would have some major concerns right now. Is this team going to be able to get out of their own head and put up a fight in this series? I mean, I guess we'll see. There were elements of this game where I thought the Leafs looked pretty good. They had you know, portions of the game where they were forechecking hard. I think you could argue that Boston was really taking advantage when they slowed up, but the Boston forwards were just taking advantage of their opportunities in a way Leafs forwards simply were not. And Toronto, especially Tavares and Matthews, were getting shots on net, but this is the one thing that I was most worried about for the Leafs, and that is the goaltending battles. Wayman was great. He's been great every matchup with the Leafs. And I also worry about Toronto's mental game. When they went down one nothing, and especially 2 nothing nothing, I had such little confidence that they would bring it back. The Leafs were like trying to focus on toughness and hitting. The Bruins were just playing. Anyway, for the actual scoring, Leafs took a lot of penalties in this one and it would really, really hurt them. John Beecher would score first for the Bees after they win a battle in their own end, go the other way. Patty Maroon now with as many points as any Toronto forward. Then again for the second goal, despite Toronto maybe overcommitting a bit physically, Boston still tougher. They get the puck back to the circle, 2-0. Jake DeBrusque would then score two straight on two straight power plays. And I mean, by that point, it was over. 4-0 going into the third. The Leafs would get one back off a tough fourth line goal. But with penalties and everything else, Trent Frederick would put it away, 5-1 Boston with the empty netter. And that's all she wrote. That was game one. I would be very, very concerned if I were a Leafs diehard. I mean, I'm still a Leafs fan. I'd love to see them get through the first round, and I'm concerned. Let me know your thoughts, however, down below.